All the rest of the opponent just made a ridiculous double question mark move. Yeah, I mean, what is this? No, all he was his opponent just gave up the... What? Do I think what all is doing correct is, is correct? I don't really like... I don't really like what all he is doing. I, I mean, the re main reason that I, I really don't like it, um, broadly speaking, is, is quite simple. Uh, all Reza had many chances to qualify for the Canons. He, he, he had the chance to play the World Cup. He chose not to play in the World Cup. There's a FIDE statement. Okay, I mean... He, he could have played he could have played in the World Cup and he chose not to play in the World Cup he chose to play limited amounts of tournaments this year so to suddenly now at the very end it's like okay but now I, now I need to try it try and get in it doesn't really he, he didn't really try he didn't try the most in 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 the opportunities that he had so that's what kind of rubs me the wrong way about it that being said um obviously uh when you look at the whole situation I mean this is part of the system, right? Like, it is what it is. Anybody can do this. Like, you know, I could go tomorrow and play it. I could go, you know, I could go play some 2,500 um, and beat them every game and get to, like, 2,850. Um, and there's nothing really that stops me from doing that. Like, that is just the reality. There's nothing that stops me from doing that. We have... Uh, FIDE statement on rating specific tournaments stay on December 18th. The mini matches featuring GM Ali Reza Ferrucci, ELO 2750 began in Chartres, France, his hometown. The eight game tournament pits Ferrucci against three veteran players with an average rating of 2497 ELO points. Concerns have arisen regarding the tournament's potential purpose, whether it was orchestrated to aid Mr. Ferrucci in boosting his rating for potential qualification into the candidates tournament in 2024. The International Chess Federation would like to point out that according to Clause 0 0.4 of its rating regulations, FIDE reserves the right to not write, rate a specific tournament. FIDE has already sent an official request to the organizers of the event. We will carefully follow and investigate all aspects of the organization of the above mentioned tournament and all the games played by its participant before deciding whether to raid it. Wait, no. So they didn't actually say they won't raid it, though. This just says they will reserve the right. Um, it just says they'll reserve the right. Um... The International Chess Federation is dedicated to addressing not just specific cases, but all similar occurrences that may arise. Discussions will be held to explore potential amendments to the FIDE rating regulation aiming to prevent such situations in the future. FIDE reiterates its unwavering commitment to upholding fair play and ensuring equal opportunities for all players. Okay, so, yeah, I mean, it, it is what it is. Um, that doesn't that doesn't really say anything. That just says they reserve the right specifically. So, we'll see. I mean, Ali, Ali Reza, of course, I mean, he could have played the FIDE World Cup. He chose not to play the FIDE World Cup. In fact, it seemed as though he made an active effort to avoid playing serious tournaments this year. Um, so he made an active effort to avoid playing serious tournaments. And now suddenly at the end, it's like it's like you have this random match against weak players. And I mean, it's within the rules, I think, but it's very, very cheesy. It's very, it's very cheesy. I mean, my, my general takeaway is simple. You probably have to have some criteria that that um you have so, you have to have some criteria that is very clear cut to prevent such a situation i don't know if you can do like average rating you can't easily do because in an open tournament someone could play an, an average rate player i think at alpha jacob for the sub months play knight f3 here um so i don't know how you do it but there's got to be some specific criteria you have in place I, I i don't really know what what it is specifically but i think you have to thoughts on dominguez withdrawing not to lose rating points yeah well dominguez i i've said it before there's so many haters out there who like to pretend that i make things up and i just do things for clicks blah 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 etc etc at the end of the day what i say is based on reality um and so like when i talk about top players and ensuring your qualification and next year's grand chess or things like this and making your income that is what top chess players are thinking about even if people want to pretend that's not the case um so with dominguez i understand his rating is 2751 um i myself made it very clear i said that in i think 2018 back before i was a back when i was a professional chess player i made um I made 40% of my income from the Grand Chess Tour. 40% of my income from the Grand Chess Tour alone. And so if you lose 40% of your income, especially at the age that Dominguez is at, that is gonna that is gonna be a very serious hit to your income. And Dominguez is already someone who's on his way towards retirement. So I mean, I, I don't I don't know why people um why people are shocked by it. To me, it's it, of course as a former professional chess player, I under I understand it completely. So yeah, I mean it's 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 just basically what it is, is what I would say goes there um i'm gonna play here i've got rook b1 i've got like knight a4 knight a4 is probably knight a4 knight c5 is just much better but who cares so okay goes rook d8 okay now i think i should take space with knight a4 maybe b4 b5 even i feel like i'm getting some space here with the two b's 
It's also knight c5. I should be better here. Knight d4, I just take. Yeah. So, yeah, as far as Dominguez goes, I completely understand it. Um, I mean, I, I think that a lot of people don't understand it, and there's a shock they withdrew, but I get it. He was worried he'd lose more rating points. Candidates was out the window, and if the candidate's out the window, you want to ensure your income for the following year, especially for someone like Dominguez, who I think has two kids. I mean, he has a family, all these things. Like, it's 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 a very logical choice, and I, I completely understand it. You know, NH Pickleball for the 34th, they ate in our chest for the 50 month resub. Appreciate it. So, yeah, I mean, I know there are going to be a lot of people like, how can you how can you say it's okay or whatever? Like, I just really like, just deal with it. Um, I'm not playing this game very well, by the way. I guess I'll, eh. I guess I'll go A3 and T. I actually don't like my position here. Maybe I take with the pawn, though. Maybe I take this. Eh, I don't know. I don't know. I could have also played Knight A6, maybe. With B5, maybe. Okay, I think now I'm just going to go... I think I'm going to go back to A4. I'm just going to sit and chill here and try to improve my position slowly but surely. Let's go here. I think eventually I want to go back. Maybe stack the rooks, maybe. See what he does. Okay, now I think I, I think I've got to go back here. He's trying to bring his knight in, so I need to put the knight back. I think now I'm gonna go a4 though. Take away this jump. Okay, let's go here. Cover the c4 square. No jump. I've got a5, b5. The two b's eventually should win me the game. But there's a very deep positional sort of situation here. Let's just give me b5. Yeah, it's getting very ugly for my opponent. I've got bishop b4 now. And now I think he's got a big problem with the queen too. I've got knight a6 with a big hook here to win material. Also knight d3, also knight b7, also queen b1. Um, this looks very das dastardly. Is that a word? I don't know if that is. Um, go here. I should be winning here. The queen b8, I have knight e6. Okay, rook b8 allows knight a6 anyway, though. Classic fossil here, and I win the... Um, this should be correct. Okay, we got the win. Two out of two. Good stuff. Let's see, Magnus, he is playing against somebody. Daniel's still playing, or... Okay, Magnus is playing Aloha Mora. Okay, Magnus has two beats. He's not probably much better, but he will win this just because of the time situation. Uh, thank you so much to that Chit Town dude for the 21 months. Appreciate it. So, um, Alarez's opponent just made a ridiculous double question mark move. Uh, are the games being relayed? Because I saw they were on Blitz streams, but I didn't see them anywhere. Are they on Chess 24? I mean, I don't, I don't know where the games are. Yeah, his opponent just made a double question mark move out of the blue. Um, oh, they are on chess.com? Okay. Yeah. Um, oh, there it is. Race of Canis, it's there. His opponent just made a double question mark move. What do you mean? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what is this? No, all I was, wait, why is the board off too, by the way? Um, oh, it's the wrong scene. Um, or, okay, there we go. Yeah, I mean, what is this? No, all I opponent just gave up the, what? What is, no, let, let me mute the sound. Let, let me mute this. Um, what is knight b3 here? You, you just take and play rook f8 and you're a little bit worse. I mean, I, I mean, White can try to pretend that he has some play here with the Knights, but Black's just much better and going to win the game. Thank you to Pop and Bugs for the 9. They had Ace of Prez for 36 months. Appreciate it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's get back to the Magnus game. Um, let's unmute this tab and keep going. Yeah, I don't I don't know what that is. Um, strange, but whatever. Yeah, you know what? You know what you, I got to be honest, you guys. You know what time it is? It's time for Anish Giri. It's 12-19. Anish Giri needs to arrange a 12-game match with his wife. 
um you know some club in in, in the netherlands and um yeah it's time for anish to organize organize like a 12 game match with his wife um you know it's a local chess club it's time for it you know it <laughs>